beautiful people welcome back to another video it's your girl Siobhan I am so excited I know you can probably see my dirty house don't worry another clean with me video is coming up but today I have an amazing $380 Walmart haul for you grocery haul and just a few more last-minute Christmas gifts that I picked up for um, family not really for the kids, but for family. So if you wanna see what I picked up in this large grocery haul, then keep on watching. Okay, family, so let's get started with this grocery slash last minute, finally done, praise Jesus, haul from Walmart. So just to let you know, I bought two of the cinnamon bread loaves and this is what i'm going to use for the french okay. strawberries blueberries and then i bought some cuties and bananas because in the morning i'm also going to cut up some fruit have a nice little fruit tray as well um you want to say hi go ahead hi i also have some eggs we are a large family if you don't know i have six kids um and we're a large family so you just can't get a little bit of eggs so I also brought two containers of the um, 12 glazed donuts. And these are $3.98 a box. Um, the kids love these. Again, it's a quick little thing for them that they love to eat. And we are off for the whole week of Christmas. And so a lot of these snacks and stuff that you'll see will be for the week that they're off. So they're not going to eat it in one or two days. It'll be for the whole week um, that they're off. So I bought a box of Lucky Charms, a box of the Cookie Crisp, and two boxes of the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. That's the family size, really reasonable at Walmart. I got some paper cups because since they're off, I don't plan on doing, if I don't have to do a lot of dishes and everything like that, then I'm not going to do it. That's just me. So I bought some hash browns right there. That'll be for breakfast. I also got bacon in the refrigerator and... Um, I believe I have sausage sausage in the refrigerator. That's why I didn't buy it. Um, but I bought some lunch meat. This is the um, hard salami. I bought some ham. Again, the cuties, the bananas. I brought spoons and forks. Again, I don't plan on doing a lot of cleaning. If I don't have to, you know, I'm going to help myself out as much as I can. So biscuits will also be for Christmas morning. Cheese. And then I have, although I can make these from scratch, I don't feel like it. So I have the, the chocolate chips. Um, so we're going to, the kids, I'm going to let those, them do that. I bought some soap, you know, stuff that you get for around the house. So I bought some Safeguard. I bought two of these, but one has already been snatched by one of the kids. <laughs> I bought some Dawn. You can never have too much hand soap. So I bought the marula oil i think that's how you say it and then also the coconut water mango that sounds i didn't even smell it but it just sounds so freaking good so i brought two gallons of two percent milk some who loves this the canada dry the cranberry ginger ale i love that love it love it love it i also i love ginger ale in general um so just so you know that's my favorite drink is ginger ale I bought two bottles of Mountain Dew. If you don't know, me and my husband, we are separated. We live in separate homes. But last year for Christmas, he did come over. I invited him over. And this year, he asked if he could come over again and spend Christmas Eve, like going into Christmas morning to see the kids open up their gifts. I'm definitely okay with that. Um, I know on one of my mom Facebook channels or Facebook pages, I know uh, people were talking, saying no, they wouldn't. You know, it wasn't my question, but they were saying, no, they wouldn't feel comfortable with that and so forth. But I'm truly okay. He can come over, see his kids anytime. He can request. He can, they can stay the night. All that. So if he want to see Christmas morning with them, I'm okay with that. Um, it's called co-parenting. And I think we do it pretty well. So I brought two things of Cool Whip, a thing of Ready Whip. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, baby. Yes, baby love. Hi. Hi, y'all. And then I have two things of ginger ale. I have two juices back here. One is lemonade and the orange. I also brought, I thought I bought, I'm missing something. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm missing a couple bags. I need to put that out. I was about to say, give me one second. 
Okay, I also bought the Minute Maid. I don't know if y'all like this, but I love it from Walmart. So it's the Mango Punch. I also bought Fruit Punch and Watermelon. So this is our juice and stuff for the week. I think that's pretty good. I brought some little cookies, Chips Ahoy, as well as the Family Size Oreo. And I have hot chocolate. I'm also um, going to do like a, I want to do like a hot chocolate station for the kids. Um, they love hot chocolate, so I think that'll be something cute that they can make and have fun. This has to be my 13th, 14th box of candy canes, but I bought more candy canes because I'm going to put those, have the kids put these on a tree. So I bought the Jolly Rancher kind. And then I also bought this Hawaiian punch. Every time I buy candy canes, I buy something different so they can try them. I think they like, you know, ooh, we even bought um, hot chocolate candy canes, red hot candy canes. We've had so many different kinds. Oh my gosh, the kids love them. So I brought two things of white bread, which I normally don't buy, but um, Walmart was getting kind of bare and I couldn't find the wheat that I always buy. So I bought this and it is what it is. I bought some bowls for them for when they eat cereal if they decide to do that. I bought some more tape. I needed that. Some more butter. I really don't need that, but um, I just picked it up. <laughs> Hello, love bug. Give me one second. I'm almost done. I bought some Renews It um, to spray after I get done cleaning up. And I also bought some NYX matte finish. This is for me. So this she also bought some soap. I did buy and soap. So some soap. hold on, let's show them what we got. We got so we got the um, soft soap body scrub and blackberry sugar, and then we also got cherry spritz. And I'm trying to read it. The way my camera is being held, it's so difficult. So just in case you know your girl can read. Anyway, <laughs> Jergens original lotion. Um. I also bought, so these are some of the, oh, I bought some, um, the garbage bags, a large thing of paper plates, sweetie, no, I don't want people to see that, no, don't touch, don't touch, so I also bought garbage bags and the large thing of paper plates, and then some of the things that I picked up, I picked up these, aren't these pretty, oh, they're so pretty, aren't they pretty, I bought these. These are a gift for another gift um, uh, for my oldest, my 20 year old. Bought that for her. And then I also picked up these eyeshadows as well as she's working a double on Christmas. So I won't actually see her on Christmas. So, and, um, but I, she, I bought her several things. So that's just additional. I couldn't pass those up. So I bought these boxers for their dad. I bought some body wash for him as well as, hold on, let me get over here. And if you're wondering why the garbage bags are open, it's because I actually cleaned out my car a little bit prior to putting the stuff in the car. In the car. Um, so I bought him this um, blue t-shirt fruit of the loom t-shirt to go with these um night pants i think they're so soft they're really look i don't know if you can see that soft touch natural stretch but these are really really nice and then that's from the kids to their dad how about this huh baby uh, yeah you can watch on my ipad in just two seconds can you give me a second Okay, wait. So I also bought this hoodie right here. And I bought these jeans for my 14 year old. So she has burgundy, black, and this jean color. And you can never have too much wrapping tissue paper. So I bought a couple things of tissue paper. And last but not least, this is an additional gift for my 25 year old sister. So I think these are very pretty too. That's probably better. Aren't they pretty? 
Oh man, the lighting is not even doing any justice. That's pretty. It's so pretty. Here's. But yeah, I think it's pretty. So I bought her that. So that is the end of this Walmart grocery haul. Again, I know my house is a mess, people. And that's the next video that I'll be doing. So I really, truly hope you enjoyed this haul. And here's my little sign right here. Oh, holy night. I know you remember that. So again, I really, truly hope you enjoyed this last minute shopping, grocery haul, gifts from Walmart. Um, it was a... You know, it was something that needed to be done. I tried to get everything done as early as possible, but I'm still pretty satisfied with um, two days left. You know, we got some stuff done. So if you have not hit the bell, if you have not subscribed, please do so. Please thumbs up the video and share, comment. I really would like to hear from you. Are you done Christmas shopping? Did you get everything you need? It was Walmart your go-to store? Was Target your go-to store? I went to Target a little bit too. I, I did, I love Target. I love Walmart. Um, but yeah, so tell me if you liked some of the things that I hauled and I also have some other stuff that I couldn't quite put out. Too many kids around. They're watching me like hawks. Yeah, there's no place. <laughs> anyway, don't forget, check out our Christmas video so you'll get to see all the stuff, you know, that I can't haul for you, <laughs> if you know what I mean yeah anyway so love you guys merry christmas i am so enjoying this season and i will talk to you guys in the next video bye